When you travel, whether that's to the beach, to another state, another country, what do you buy as a souvenir to remind you of where you were? I, I have to get a magnet, first okay. of all. And sometimes, <laughs> depending on where it is, I have maybe a shirt or a koozie. Okay, mm -hmm. so I just got back from a trip to Europe, similar to you, yes. and I got a necklace. I'm a big jewelry girl, so uh -huh. I had to get a necklace. Um, with the, one of them is the cross in Italy, and then the other one is um, the seashells off of the coast of Pompeii, right there off of the coast of Italy. Okay, cool. Um, Those are cool. Same thing with the bracelet. I, I'm just a huge jewelry girl. And of course, I did get a couple of magnets and um, little wine stoppers, but mm -hmm. for the most part, I love my jewelry. I don't know what it is. What about you, Tanya? I like that idea. I have a lot of hats. It seems like every time <laughs> I go somewhere, I get a hat that shows, you know, where it was, right? But let me tell you this. I want to show you what my husband bought because it was not a hat. Not a hat. <laughs> oh. Wait for it. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Why, yes, that is indeed a cuckoo clock. It now lives in our house, but it used to live here at a store in the Black Forest in Germany. Wow. This store in Triburg had 1,000 clocks. Wow. All different sizes, <laughs> different music, motifs, but they all had one thing in common. And that is the cuckoo that comes out. <laughs> okay. I would have kicked him to the curb. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Just because of the noise. Well, when I got home yesterday, I said, okay, the ticking. Okay, that's number one for me. And then right. I was like, the cuckoo, is it going to keep us up all night? And he right. said, no. And oddly, I did not hear it all night long. Oh. Really? And so I woke up this morning going, okay, he was right. And then he goes, well, there's a secret switch. And I turned it off last night. So you there's a, How much of a secret oh. is it, right? Well, he said, I'm not telling you where it is. And I'm like, oh, no. <laughs> You are. You definitely are. Well, you know, this would be a great thing for my fiance who who doesn't look at the time ever. Oh, really? Uh -huh. He has a terrible track record of keeping time. Like, he just cannot, he's always late. So maybe I need him to get him well, a Well, let me tell you, clock. the cuckoo will not only tell you when it's on the top of the hour, but it's on the half oh, hour, too. No. Oh, See, wow. This is probably a dumb question, but is there a difference? I mean, are you able to tell just by listening to it um, how, what time it is? Yeah, like it chimes one or two or three okay, or so four. Okay, so it does or, that. Yes, mm -hmm. or 12. And then what is, at the half hour, what does it do? Uh, is it just like a I can't remember what that one does. Okay. Wait, how did you get it back from, did you just put it in your suitcase? No, or? no, no, no. So, you know, when you buy something like that, they ship it to you. Oh. Yeah, there's no okay. way you're putting that in your suitcase, I was going right? to say, I was going to no. say, that would have been crazy. But let me just say, it is beautiful, and I imagine it was not cheap. And it was hand carved. Yep. Wow. Right? And it reminds him of his grandparents' oh, cuckoo clock. So it's got sentimental you know, value as well. Well, I posted this on Facebook to see what the folks said about what they collected from vacation. So here's the post that shows the clock. But it asks, what did you buy when you travel? And I got a lot of comments about the cuckoo clock. Apparently, a lot of people <laughs> had them in their parents' and their grandparents' house. But a lot of people said this. Josh Robertson says, magnets. And he's been to some really fun places. I love that he put pictures in here. And then Daryl Walken says lapel or hat pins are the souvenir of choice because they're inexpensive and easy to pack. Mm -hmm. And then later they sent me another picture because they make like a wall hanging that has each one of the pins in it so that they can remember oh. it. Oh, that's awesome. Mm -hmm. Remember when people collected spoons? Yes. Do people still do that? Yes. Spoons. I love spoons. Shot glasses, okay. any of those things. I love right. the little spoons. You can little, join yes, in yes. on Facebook about what you buy when you're on vacation. Cuckoo! For Cocoa Puffs. <laughs>